let's start this shit. Hey, good luck to both players. Yeah. Right. For this first round, looks European. Yellow license plates. Oh, the flag. <laughs> Ginormous flag. <laughs> As for the and I am uh, on team Breco and yeah, Breco has the right country here, it's the Netherlands, very, uh, very clearly on oh. But Musk was closer, it was closer to them, wow. Well, I've just loaded into the map. <laughs> All right. I can actually see this one, so um looking more eastern european getting a bit of oh you've got the thin line i think uh bixel said it to me like yesterday where that was the thin line on the on the plates or on the on the sides. Oh yeah. I didn't even notice that. Musk Might be Poland though. I'm gonna look at this. I think Musk has guessed Poland, yeah. Um No, it's actually Lithuania if I look at this. <laughs> yeah. Oh uh, Mus Musk got it correct. Alright and Brico. Uh, two strong Europe rounds here for Musk to start with. Well, uh, but yeah, of course, Brico being an American probably has more experience in uh, in the Americas, which we are right now. I think this this looks quite American. I think so Brico has guessed somewhere. And uh, Musk has gone for Europe actually. No, it, it was Russia. <laughs> I was I was completely wrong here. Oops, my bad. The first damage that Musk gets. Just uh, any chance we do a community world? Well, it was well, decided long ago that it would be diverse world. So this is looking once again to be Musk's territory. It does indeed. Very, very Euro uh, centered rounds here. Are you sure you clicked the right one? Actually, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Quite sure, yeah. Because as we know from experience, the Europe maps for GeoGuess are just uh, Italy, France, and Spain normally. <laughs> We've got a bit more diversity. Um, thinking Hungary here, but could be wrong. I saw a lot of accents, so. Yeah, it's definitely around like kind of Eastern European. Yeah, area. yeah, yeah. Maybe like. Czechia. Oh, Czechia, okay. With Brico and Belgium. They, these are uh, not very. And finally, we're out. US of friendly. But yeah, this is uh, South America here, so. With the white lines in the middle. Uh, actually, no, it's left hand drive as well. Oh, this no, then it's not South America at all. Then uh, it's Asia. Yeah. yeah. Malaysia or Indonesia would be my guess. Yeah. Yeah, you can tell a lot on the roads by the, uh, the road markings and the road signs as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, because the EU tend to use like, more of the blue signs and the, they tend to be a lot more round, whereas kind of the rest of the world uses the yellow like diamond shaped signs and then also yellow lines in the middle of the road tends to be um like the americas apart from when it isn't <laughs> it tends to be a lot of things with you i guess to be honest and both players taking their time here yeah i don't blame them this is a yeah a I, I haven't found anything yet yeah uh, I found my first 
like a sign with some writing on it and it doesn't help at all. Oh yeah, same. Um, honestly, yeah, looking um, more um, Malaysian to me. Yeah. And well, Rico guess. as well going for Malaysia here. Must guess uh, Indonesia, I think. It was Malaysia, but Musk is closer. <laughs> it was wow. Indonesia, I guess. Oh, wow. And Draco almost, almost out. He needs uh, a big uh, NA round here. So yeah. That back. Don't think he's got it with this. This is... This is looking... Huh? Left hand like drive? A... It's... It's looking UK, to be honest. UK? Nah, 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 nah. This is uh, either Australia or like New Zealand. Oh, I didn't actually get to the main road. I just saw a sign which says, Beware of the dog. <laughs> There's a lot of angry dogs in UK. Yeah. Can you blame them? They're in the UK. Okay, I just noticed I can't actually mute this music or. Where's the, where's the setting here? Ah, sound. Music, music volume. Very silent in the background. Almost best leave game. Um, do you know what the great thing with this map is? We have one of those roads where you try and go forwards and you go backwards. Oh. Oh, and I've got to a no through road. I guess I'm not lighting much from here. Yeah, I'm not finding a lot of it either. But I have found that it's by the sea, wherever it is. Not that that might that might help, that might not. It just helps a little bit for pinpointing. And on which side is the sea? Oh yeah, that's a good point. Uh, kind of southeast, southish. Yeah, I, I'm thinking this would be like. Uh, Southeast Australia. Good thing. Uh, I'm still I'm like fine right now. in the small roads and yeah, so can't really find it. But this is a very dangerous uh, round for both players. Actually. That's true, and they are taking their time. They they do not yeah. want to mess things up with two and a half times damage here. Yeah, especially because Australia is so big as a country. Like, even if you just guess the other side. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Guess, this this, this could decide it. And Musk goes for the guess. Musk has gone for a guess, but he's gone for the Philippines. Oh. That is a brave shout. That's a brave shout. This could win him the game. No, be it's I don't it's left-hand drive. Uh, Philippines yeah. is right-hand drive, so... It's South Africa. It was South Africa. <laughs> and Musk he actually has more... Power. A higher score with this Philippines guess. Okay. It does, did not look like South Africa to me. Not at all. Everyone bamboozled here. Uh, is this another Europe? This looks like another Europe to me. Um, I saw an accent on one of the things. I nah, I might not be. Europe has only has accents. It was the only place with accents. Yep. Uh, looks, I don't know what to make of the language, to be honest. It, this looks uh, Turkish. To me. It's Mut in Turkey. Yeah. I don't want to, like, drag to move the map, so I'm just gonna zoom. So that I don't accidentally click. Turkey does have the blue D roads. Um, yeah. That was uh, shown on the sign there, so I think I think you might be onto something with Turkey there. And you can see, I think, on this side, that looks like the sea, so maybe it's like here somewhere. Yeah. But Brico went for the gas. Where did he place it? Middle of Turkey, yeah. Yeah. Safe. Must safe gas. And so Musk Brico's was uh, Bulgaria, so. Oh, that wow. is not it yet. Oh, wow. Whoa, <laughs> 64 points. This is a great one to start with. This round's basically winner takes all now. And it yep. looks like with the yellow line in the middle, there's a chance we are in the Americas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And 
looks Spanish esque. Yeah, so, this is looking. Yeah, South America somewhere. It's looking, yeah, but it's looking like it's quite near the equator, I think, just judging mm -hmm. where the sun is. But yeah, three and a half times with either one having a. Uh, Basically, they both less have. Than 500 points, so. Yeah, they both have to be really far off for this to carry into another round. Or both, like, on on top of one another. Yeah. Either really close or really far away. Let's see what we have here. That's flat as well. And Bricko made a guess. Where's he gone for? Uh, for Mexico. Musk has done the same. Gone for South Mexico. Yep. Brico for Mexico City, let's see. And it was way closer to Mexico City. And this is Brico taking it. Wow. That what was a final. great game. GG to both players there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's a great way to start the tournament. Brico taking a lot of damage in the early rounds and then in the last two rounds, just bring it back very well done. And let me quickly Yeah, so Brico will now go on to play Bixel, I believe in the next round yes indeed and musk drops down to losers round one where he will face loser of loopy versus uh, an anonymous source so next up we have chess versus vt Probably get the tournament bracket up so I can actually see. There we go. Yeah, also, uh, don't spoil when you come out because everyone's on a two minute delay, so. Uh... They they probably don't want to be spoiled, especially with the uh, match that's close. Yeah. Right. So V oh no, it doesn't matter. I was gonna tell them to join the open game, but then I remember that there's a delay. Quickly changing the scoreboard here. Flag of Norway. Where's the flag of Norway? Oh. And it seems they're both ready. Yep, they're both good. Quickly to go. double checking. All right, then we will start the next round. VT on Team Red, Chess Team Blue, I think. Uh, yeah, I think so. This would be an interesting game for us because both of these uh, players are pretty knowledgeable with the game, but we for haven't sure. seen much of them playing either of them. So it's going to be interesting to see. Uh, is that South Africa. I just saw, yeah. saw a truck with uh, ZA and <laughs> .CA. Yeah. And I'm guessing Chess found it as well. VT going Which, for South Africa. Uh, yeah, Chess did as well. Yeah. Went for the and I was a great guess from Chess to start with. 
Very yeah, most strong. most of the locations in South Africa are, are around Johannesburg there, so or more northeast. And we have uh, USA, no Canada, I think. What is it here? Saint John, this, this is Sussex. Like, yeah, this is looking like. Uh, yeah, that's French. Quebec, or yeah, I think it's Quebec. Judging by the shape. Uh, is that Quebec? VT going for the border between Kentucky and Tennessee. So I don't think he saw the the French on the side. Yeah. Uh, oh, Chess has got a good guess in New Brunswick. Yes. And there we go. Very good guess. Found pretty much the exact road as well. And that's almost yeah, probably with Sussex. He, uh, yeah. He, he knew where that was. Very nice guess from him there, and already VT on the back foot. Uh, looking South America, seeing a yeah. lot of Spanish, and with these tuk tuk cars or whatever they're called, the it's that looking like Peru. Bad. Yeah, I think I, I think I can see some Peruvian flags, so that would make sense. I just know a lot of these Dr. cars. It's, uh, it's Peru. <laughs> <laughs> now, where in Peru? Provincial de Loreto Nauta. I just found a sign there, so that should be able. Uh, it should be pinpointable. Chess going with the guess and VT, not in Peru, in central Mexico. And this chess went for Indonesia. Wow. Oh, wow. VT able to call some points back there. That was a pretty poor round for both players, to be mm -hmm. honest. It's a Especially bad sign if, like <laughs> as we were both like, oh, yeah, this is Peru. <laughs> yeah. It's a bad sign when I get the country and they don't. <laughs> uh, right. It's a place called Whiskey. This is looking kind of Austrian to me. Yeah. Austrian, maybe um, Swiss? Potential, yeah. Uh, and I don't know what VT's gone for, but this should play into VT strengths again, being from Europe. Chess might struggle a bit more with this one. He went for Hungary, Slovenia, the border there. Interesting. I think Very Swiss. interesting guess there. And yeah. Chess was a great guess, though. Chess was Austria, I guess. A bit closer yeah, right. there but of course in your hope everything is close by so not yeah. too many points for grabs there this looking mighty tie and chess found language as well yeah pt yeah middle of thailand yeah chess has gone middle of thailand as well not gone maybe as far south as you normally do Interesting. Good thing too, because it was to the left. Um, chess doing a tiny bit of damage there. I don't 14 think that points. The, the, those 14 points are going to be decisive. Yeah, so. if, if they do, then uh, we've got a serious, serious uh, competition on our hands. Uh, oh wow, this is, a, this is a road. In the middle of nowhere. Yeah. So let's let's uh, get some predictions in. Where, where would this be? <laughs> Uh, looking at the van, I'd say it looks kind of Eastern European. They've got the double like dots over the O's, uh, right. but it's double dots over the O's. Hmm. Then I would say Turkey. Interesting. It looks a bit too like it's got too much grass and vegetation and stuff for Turkey for me. Well, yeah, but hmm. yeah, possibly Eastern Europe, but I. I don't know where there's like this much space if it's not in Cyrillic country. What? Oh, it was actually Russia. But chess with the turkey guess and getting a uh... He went for Austria. I mean, Austria, there's not really. <laughs> 
that much space. I would have gone for yeah, Ukraine, Turkey, Romania maybe, but All right, GG's to both players. Yeah, GG to both. We'll uh, quickly check in on the brackets. Oh god. Yep. The bracket is a bit fucked up now. <laughs> uh oh. So nice. with that, well, Ches Chess goes through to round three. Um, Yes. BT will be dropping down into the loser's bracket. He's not out yet. He will play the loser of Bixel and Bricko, which will be a wild fight. Yeah. But next up's the big match. Oh, yeah. The big match is incoming. Let me quickly get. Uh, right, I'll set up the game. Sorted. Oh, that's nice. Australia and Belgium are both in the beginning of the alphabet, so the flags are easy to set. <laughs> right, so we're going and for this is round two. Yep. Bearhead's going to be playing some interesting tactics. He's already chosen to be on the red team. Yep. Uh, I'm also probably going to leave voice chat, so, you know, yep. fair is fair. Hey, uh, have I got the settings good? Do we have healing on? Oh, it doesn't matter because I can't do it in team. So. But yeah, I'll, uh, I'll see you in a bit after I beat Bearhead. Okay. Uh, uh, okay, here's the match. Okay, <laughs> let's go. The Austrian car, yeah. Fair enough. Um, okay. I've got some Cyrillic. Car look like oh that mm, that's not red is it? It was just like a brake light. I got excited about the brake light. Yeah no I don't think it's a red car. But maybe, just maybe. Because this this do be looking mighty Ukrainian. Is it Ukrainian or uh, Russian? So I think it's a shout to just put it like over here. the first point. Oof. Hurts. Oh, this is a new car. It's one of the new cars. Uh, the fact that we're driving on the left think means we're in Kenya. What's with the double antenna? Okay, there had got Kenya as well, nice. 51 points, I'm on the board. Okay. 
be able to. We have a follow car. Question is, is this Jordan or is this Tunisia or maybe like UAE? What's the language underneath here? Go for Jordan. Might be completely wrong here. Nope, it was Jordan. But he was closer. God damn it. <laughs> very close rounds here. Very, very close rounds. Okay, we've got a white car. Bolivian color, so yeah, let's just go here. I wanna say it's Bolivia. What should be be like? No, no. It was Bolivia nice? First real difference here. That's immediately a big one. Meisterleistung, okay. What does that say? Uh, Look in German. I think I want to go German here. Got a bit of a buffer, so let's just go south of Germany. But we're close to Austria and uh, in Switzerland as well. Although it more looks like uh, Western Germany. Oh, it was Austria. Okay, see that that's that's why I <laughs> went south. If I'm wrong. Here. If this is Australia, I'm, I'm gonna get fucked. Let's hope it isn't. or South Africa. Hello. What does that say? Timbola. Well, going for it. I'm going for South Africa here. Hedging my bets. Damn it. Oh, 
Oh. Hey, that's probably me out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's me out. Oh. <laughs> Uh, GG to Bearhead, man. GG. Australia, the one country he is far better than me at. Well, it was Australia. <laughs> <laughs> I thought it was, but I wasn't sure. Yeah, same. <laughs> Problem is, Bearhead's just deadly in Australia. Like he knows yeah, yeah, it's yeah. Australia, and he, most of the time. That I was, I was like, yeah, if if this is Australia, I'm probably gonna lose. <laughs> okay, and uh, yeah, next up nice. we have Loopy versus an anonymous source. Wait, 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 wait. I just saw something. Did you set it to uh, Diverse World? Yes. Okay. Nice try. <laughs> <laughs> no, no, no. It, it wouldn't have made a difference, but still. Uh... No, I, I definitely did change it. Right. No, no. It's a... Uh... Well... It's not like I'm out. That's true. You will play somebody. A winner of Musk and the okay, League. Now versus to, the loser this game. to spell anonymous. Is he American? Yes, or Canadian, one of the two. I think I'll you are. Check in a bit. Once I have Israel here, speedrun.com. US. US, okay. So, second to last. Game of round two about to start. Confirm they're ready, then we will start. Loopy versus an anonymous source. This will be an interesting one. Again, yep. two pretty much unknowns to us, right? I mean, Loopy's played a bit with us, but not too much. Mm -hmm. Uh, instantly, this is Brazil. You can yeah, tell yeah, by yeah. the road marking saying BR one five three. I was looking uh, at the uh, Morao, the A with the with like the squiggly line on top. That's Portuguese. Yeah. Uh, and the fact that it's a BR road, so the letters before mean that it's a national road across Brazil. I believe if it's an uh, wait, if it's BR, it's... then that's around Brazil, you know. Uh, I can't remember. I know it's to do with states. Yeah, yeah, I think it's, uh... Oh no, those are DF. My bad. <laughs> yeah. But, I don't know, my source with uh, the first guest, Loopy. Guests. 
all the way at the Peruvian border. Interesting. And it's the state of the Cantins. Yeah. That the BR roads is in. Uh, yeah. So the BR roads mean they're national roads. Uh, I believe if it's a. Oh, if it's okay. Not, if it starts with a one, I believe it goes north or south. If it starts with a two, I believe it goes east to west. Now this looks like uh, Canada. Uh, yeah, it's definitely North America, so maybe some advantage for Anonymous here. Well, <laughs> uh, let's go down a bit and see what's uh, happening over there. Rocks, rocks are happening here. Oh, we went the same way. <laughs> <laughs> Classic. It's miles per hour, so. Do they use miles per hour in Canada? Canada's kilometers. Yeah, Canada's so. Miles. <laughs> uh, what? <laughs> so not it nice. is north. Well, maybe not north, north of the US, but it looks pretty. It looks like it's the northern side of maybe the Rocky Mountains, so. Yeah. In which case it would be kind of around the states of kind of Washington, Montana, maybe that kind of area. Yeah, or like Minnesota, North Dakota. Well, if it's Minnesota, that's straight into Anonymous's uh, home area, I believe. That's what a speedrun okay. tells us. Home state is Minnesota. Yep, he's from Minnesota indeed. Loopy has guessed, and Loopy guessed Oregon, south of Oregon. Interesting. Maybe he I, found a sign that I, we didn't see. I agree see. with that kind of guess. Uh, anonymous and guess. Very anonymous. much. Wow. Very anonymous close there. Virginia. Great guess for Loopy there. Yep. He probably found a sign that we didn't find. <laughs> <laughs> very nice one there. And it looks like we are back in. Uh, Malaysia. Sarawak. Where's that? That's. Indonesia, Malaysia. Yeah, one of the two. <laughs> difficult. It's difficult to uh... distinguish them. Yeah, this from me. Oh, it's Malaysia. Just saw it on the side. Ah, cool. Yeah, it's uh, already quite close to death for an anomalous source, so... Yeah. Can't afford to be too much, too far from uh, where it is. Yeah. So when you get countries like this, it's not just important to know kind of how quickly you can tell the country. It's also important to know what parts of the country are usually covered. Mm -hmm. Like by the geo guess the car, because kind of when it comes to Indonesia, Malaysia, there's a lot of islands you can go for and kind of a lot of distance you can kind of miss by even if you're in the right country. Yeah, and for Malaysia, I think most of it is on the mainland. But sometimes you have on uh, Borneo. And yeah, that's... yeah, I think Borneo tends to be a bit rarer. Than but yeah, Lupi in the middle of mainland, Malaysia. Yeah. That's where I would guess, to be honest. Uh, I think Chess, uh, not Chess, Anonymous has guessed the same. And it was, and it was right next to Brunei. Wow. <laughs> 11 points. That's a lot of damage. Okay, left uh, hand Looking right. Japanese. Yep, immediately. Looking. Yeah. So now we played a game of is it Japan or is it Taiwan? It's uh, they're driving on the left, so it's definitely Japan. Right. Only thing that could be like sometimes uh, a bit confusing is sometimes in Malaysia you find uh, Chinese. True. Yeah. But yeah, no, just. The roads, the the arrows that point there. 
these echoes, by the way, are for when it's uh, in winter. It snows a lot in Japan. And then you, they point at the edge of the road. So oh, cool. you know I can't go past that line if it's covered by snow. I was guessing in almost an identical place, but it was one in Northern Ireland. So Hokkaido. Hokkaido. Not a lot of guess guesses, in it. like not a lot of times you go in Hokkaido, but yeah. Oh, I thought that car had been in a really bad accident, but now it's just a geo guessing camera. <laughs> uh, I'd say this is again looking European. Yes. They're driving on the left, though. Which. Are they? Yeah. Uh, like maybe just maybe this is just a one way street. Yeah, it's a one way street. Because it's yeah. uh, HR, not HR, so. Hungary, maybe? No. Wait, what's dot HR? Because Hungary, I think, is dot HU. Loopy goes for Hungary. Okay, this could be an interesting one if uh, Anonymous knows where HR is. <laughs> as long as HR doesn't know where you are. It was... In Croatia. Interesting. I wouldn't have thought that. Yeah. Same. But then it's not often that Croatia comes up, actually. Also true. Uh, this is looking. Uh, well, it's again Europe, Spain, yeah. right? the better looks of things. Yeah, it's uh, like two blue uh, stripes on the license plate. Yeah. So that's. Uh, think Old France and Spain. Yep, there is a road sign up ahead. I think Loopy got to that a bit quicker than me. And, uh... Loopy went for Italy, though. Huh? Also, not a bad guess. I'd say, yeah, it's Italy, it's Roma Napoli. Yeah. There was a sign there. They both guessed in exactly the same place. Both. Campo Basso. Yeah, so, oh yeah, it's it's Italy and France, I think, with the two blue stripes. Right. Then. And old Portugal had an orange stripe. That's also not really there anymore. Okay, so, now we play the game. Is it Australia or South Africa? <laughs> Looking more South African to me. I'd agree with that. It's a game I'm pretty bad at. But then there is a road called the Avenue and that does strike me as more Australian than South African. Well, there's pretty big parts of uh, South African that are English. Yeah, true. Some uh, signs here. See if we can find yeah, no, I something think right. useful. Uh, I mean, looks quite African. Yeah. Kokstad, mooi draai, vrij uitzicht. It's very uh, Afrikaans sounding. That's what I thought of the street name when <laughs> I guessed South Africa in my game. But apparently, they also have really weird name, uh, street names in Australia. Yeah, it's Cockstad. So, where would that be? Anonymous's guest for South Africa again near Pretoria. And um, Loopy, see where he guesses. Uh, west of East Bottini. Yep. And oh, it was south. quite south. Interesting. But Loopy does a, again a little bit more damage. He's just chipping away right now. Yep. But it's oh, getting it into the rounds that it could be uh, uh -oh. over for anyone. This is UK. This is UK, 
Uh, so I'm actually gonna like try and find a place. For <laughs> as long as you don't click on the map. I won't. This is looking like a tiny village, though. Um, Crosscomb village stores. Like yeah, comb. I, no I yesterday I was. Uh, there's there's a lot of combs in uh, around Plymouth, in that area. Yeah, I think it's to do with like near a seafront or something. My favorite is uh, Woolacomb. Yes, there was also Ipswich. <laughs> Ipsy. <laughs> I was losing my mind watching that. <laughs> it's Crosscomb. Please drive carefully. Try if okay, so it's the A371. Uh, if they find that, A371. In, the UK, in the UK, the road numbers work radially around London. So, kind of north, northeast ish is number one. Then you work your way around in six segments. So, uh, the A3 is kind of. Like bottom left of London, around that kind of area, heading over to Wales. So if they know that, that will help them quite a lot. Uh, and then yeah. like a couple more. So it is close Scotland. to Plymouth, <laughs> like Exeter, or uh, whatever not, it is. It's not Exeter. Quite, it's, it's a lot further around actually. It's near Wells. Is it? Yeah. Oh. Uh, where you were yesterday was around the twos, I think. Yeah, so Wells is there. Um, Wait, and then this where's one. Wells? So if you go Bristol, a bit further Oh, Yeovil. You've got Yeovil. <laughs> yeah, it's north of Yeovil. Oh, yeah, there. And it's uh, 361 or what? 371. 371. Oh, yeah, A371 here. Yeah. But and if you have a comb, then it's probably seaside, no? Uh, not necessarily. Oh no, your temple comb is uh, not seaside. So. Uh, where's the uh, 371? Getting around by zooming is, is difficult. <laughs> <laughs> oh, cross comb! I, I found it. Cool. It's uh, right next to Wells. Is it right there? Right east of Wells. You've got Dullcote and then Crosscomb. Oh, yep. Got it. And it's on the way to Dinder as well, so we're... Uh... And we are... Where did we spawn? <laughs> we, we're we're going to pinpoint this. And these guys are just chilling or something. <laughs> Church Street and I think on the big road through, so... Yeah, we're on the big road and... Right near Church Street. Yeah, by the way, Origin, you can click on the map. It doesn't... You, you're up, the other player can't see it. Uh, but if you press guess, obviously, then... No, 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 but if you click... Then it will also count as a guess after they... Oh, will it? Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, you don't have to lock in. Well, they, they both found it. So Anonymous bit. found the A371, Luffy yeah. found the A361. Which is interesting. A bit further north, Loopy actually getting a little bit closer with that. Uh, oh, wow. Okay, UK again. Oh. Sick. White like bridge. To me, this is looking a lot more like either Wales or Scotland. Androhe Ban. That's. Isn't that Irish? Uh, I th no, I think this might be Scotland. Judging by the like emblem that was on one of the signs I saw, I think it might be Scotland. Might because be. Yeah. I Ireland and Scotland have very similar languages. So fair, uh, fair. Gaelic. Now, now to find Whitebridge. You're not going to be able to find it. It's a very small place, by the looks of things. <laughs> You're not going to be able to find it. Excuse me. <laughs> <laughs> It has an hotel. It has an hotel. 
I mean, Thane Road. That's a very well. Yeah, given the fact I've just gone through the entire thing. Um, actually, Antoche. That's that's very Scottish. I'd put money on yep. this being a Scottish, maybe around like Fort William kind of area, because I know Fort William is like Angerastan or something Scottish. Fort. Fort what? <laughs> oh, Fort William, yeah. Yeah, Fort William. Huh. It's probably near a river or something. As it uh, is a white bridge. Yes. It definitely looks like kind of the Scottish Highlands type of area. The sheep and everything. Um, Anonymous has guessed. Anonymous has gone for near London. That's a that's a guess. That's. Yeah, Will that's be, a guess. I mean, he's got the right country, probably. Yeah. We assume. And yeah, oh, Loopy also. Scotland. But Loopy a bit more north of them, so a bit more damage to an anonymous source. Uh, fun fact: I've actually been. I've probably seen that place, but walking <laughs> along the other side of Loch Ness, because we did a walking trip, uh, like along the side. Oh, of Loch we've Ness. got a new new car here. And Tala give. I think this is uh, Senegal. Yeah. It's always more difficult to tell Senegal now because you used to be able to tell it from just, ah, yeah. there's tears in the sky. For but sure. with this new generation of cars, that isn't as much of an option anymore. But it's driving on the right, so it's either with the new car, it's either Senegal or Nigeria, I think. Uh, there was also some new car in Kenya, because you and Bear had had that. Yeah, but but that's uh, left side yeah. driving. Yeah. Left hand driving. So... And it's l looking... more Senegal. <laughs> the <Yeah>. vibe! <laughs> it's the vibe! <laughs> uh -oh. Origins had that experience with GeoGuessr now, he just, he just knows the vibe. Smell it. <laughs> I'm interested where these road markings are because these are quite rare road markings. The fact that you have dash lines on the inside and outside uh, of the road. It'll be interesting if that, like, we see that that becomes a certain region of Senegal. Well, if you go backwards, the dashes on the inside disappear. Oh, really? I've, I've gone the other way then. Yeah, it's, a, it's now, for me, it's a full line now. If this is a new area, does that mean that they've like expanded more west, maybe? With the uh, yeah, west. Uh, what west? East. Yeah, the only thing you could guess was like west and north, or the only place you could be. But now it's indeed a bit more east and also the south, uh, south of Gambia. They also added a couple of right. roads there. So this will be an interesting kind of lottery for these guys. Yep. Given that it is Senegal. Deba. Okay. Just enter Deba. Aha. I'm going the same way oh, as you. And Anonymous has guessed. Uh, okay. In the middle of pretty much nowhere. That seems like a guess to put pressure on Loopy rather than a guess of. Uh, and where? Senegal. In what country? Senegal. Okay, so we did put but, Senegal, yeah. And yeah. Loopy went for Russia. That's a big result. Yep. Big comeback victory there. GG and both. Anonymous source takes it. GG's. Wow. That last one. I think, yeah, Loopy had no idea and just at the last second put placed it down somewhere. Yeah. That was a smart guess for Anonymous to put some time pressure on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, it means Loopy will be playing uh, Musk in the like, first of the losers round matches. But uh, coming up right now will be Bixel against Breco. Yep. Let me quickly... This 
And find the finish flag. Boom. Uh, Fun fact so far, both me and Origin have been present in uh, four of the GeoGuessr matches because we've been on each team. Uh, currently, I'm 3-1 up. <laughs> <laughs> well, I lost of my own accord once. So. <laughs> well. Right, so... Just got a GG from Bearhead, very nice. So now we have Pixel. And Mind if I start a prediction for this match? Sure, go ahead. Just don't end it too soon, you know, that they don't yep. get spoiled. Don't worry, I'll forget to end it. That's not. <laughs> Uh, quickly jump into team duel so they can join. Oh yeah, good point. I should just do play again <laughs> instead of just quitting out. Loopy just joined. Loopy just. <laughs> Loopy's in the game room. Loopy, get the fuck out. <laughs> Let's have Loopy's left. You're ah, good. there we go. Okay, diverse worlds. Everything's ready. The last match of Round two for the, between Pixel and Brico. Both are ready, so let's start. So far on predictions, we have a 5.5k on Pixel and we have 470 on Brico. Uh, Pixel I've played with a lot, so I know his, uh, he's a really good player. Uh, Rico, straight away with, straight away we've seen uh, win, but we've also seen that he's uh, a bit less good on uh, Europe. It's a, it's a bit weak, weaker there. Rico already going for big guess though. Yeah, so straight up we kind of spawned next to a sign with a precedent for a flag. Um, my brain I did not, not see that, wow. My brain's not working today, so I can't remember the flag, but I think my brain's got it. Yeah, it was... Uh, Philippines. Where did you see the flag? <laughs> it was like just a small Oh, that just sounded Russian, okay. <laughs> Loopy just said it in the chat. Oh, and we are in... But it looks like Korea for this. Yep, this is South Korea. And straight away they're given the road sign. Bixel, or Brico, sorry, just going for a big guess straight away. That's yeah, a bold yeah. middle of South Korea. Just mm. going fast. That's a bold uh, strategy because you're giving Bixel 15 seconds to be able to find the road and try and pinpoint the right location. But, but it's oh, it was so north. Wow. Wow. Now, being around Seul is never a bad guess because there's a lot of roads there. And it looks like we have a snorkel now. Especially uh, Bixel will definitely know what country this is. But also Brico immediately Kenya. These, yep. Both of these guys are veterans here. <laughs> yeah, Bixel going for pretty much Nairobi. Uh, and now, now, now people are saying root commentator. What did you do, Origin? I don't know. I said something during the, <laughs> the loopy match, I guess. All right. Oh, this is an interesting spawn. Straight over a river. But it looks a bit not much to see. 
This one might be there for a while before anyone actually finds something here. Yeah, it's in the middle of some very dry fields. Yeah. I wonder whether anyone can tell anything from the landscape here. Kind of looking at the mountains in the background. I certainly can't. But I'm going to have a bold guess here and say Greece. It does. Just I mean, by looking at the landscape and the mountains in the background and stuff. They are, there are European signs there, definitely. So it's definitely somewhere in Europe. I mean, I was trying to look at graffiti to tell, but if it is Greece, I definitely cannot read Greek graffiti. Brico going for Spain? Pixel going for Spain as well. So, yeah, I didn't move that much, so they probably, uh, yeah. Yeah, they moved a bit. And Brico uh, being closer here. So we're pretty much even now, just 300 yeah. points in it. Close one to start with. There's some signs here, right on spawn, and we have Cyrillic. Looks Russian, Ukraine, one of the two, maybe? Um, let me see. Uraguba. <laughs> that's, a, that's a nice name. Uh, doesn't look Ukrainian, but maybe it is. The yellow line in the middle, you can probably be able to disting distinguish from that. Brico went uh, Western Russia. Pixel hasn't guessed yet. Pixel guessed Northern Russia. And, and it was wow. very Northern Russia. Close to Murmansk. Wow. That's uh, Pixel that. getting a bit closer there, but still quite even here. This is looking like some island nation. Uh, .sh, what? No, that's a name, never mind. <laughs> it looked it look like a website. It started with a W and I stopped reading from that point on. <laughs> no, it's, uh, it's Indonesia. I think Bixel also yeah. just saw the flag. Uh, yeah, interesting. Guest uh, pretty much right on Jakarta. Okay. Northern Java here. Or, I guess, Western Java. And Brico went... N oh! Malaysia, wow. actually. But, yeah. No, that's kind of one of the most eastern points of Indonesia there. Yeah. Oh, is this our first uh, Scandinavia of the tournament? Possibly, yeah. It looks like it. Just judging by the trees, this looks kind of like Finland, to be honest. Yeah, Finland, um, yeah. It's, it's quite rare for us to actually have gone this long without a Scandinavia. Even though we've had two UKs, Scandinavia is usually a lot more common than UK is. Oh, I found a sign with some name on it. Let's see, what does this look like? Oh yeah, that's, that looks very uh, Finnish. And quite northern Finland, judging from the lack of anything. This is the exact kind of road you'd expect, like, a rally stage on. <laughs> and Brico went... Actually, Saskatchewan. Oh. Saskatoon he went for. Interesting. So I mean Pixel this 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 guess. might be a home guess for Pixel and yes yeah. it was. Very southern Finland actually, we were wrong. That's true, and but that's oh, and that's wow. just instant that <laughs> Pixel takes this one. And, and it's by far the biggest winning margin we've had so far. Yeah. Forty five hundred points. Wow, I'm guessing he didn't see the signs with the, the names and just was thinking, oh, ah, yeah. let's just go for it. <laughs> okay, then that's a wrap on round two. Now we start with the losers' rounds. Um, let me update the brackets real quick. Pixel going through facing Cheswis in the next round. 
and Brico dropping down facing VT. Uh, but next up, we have Loopy versus Musk. And it's nice because now we have had everyone, so my program for the, uh, the scoreboard already knows the flags <laughs> to put uh, on. So, so you could be lazy now, is what you're saying? Yep. Yep. Let's take a quick look at the brackets again. And both seem to be ready, so uh, let's jump right into it. Oh. Gonna take a quick swig of water. How dare you. All right, and we will start. So this is our first elimination match. The loser of this match will be out of the tournament completely, so... And the winner will face me. <laughs> ah, so... Slightly easier path for the winner here, but... <laughs> <laughs> Very true. I see an American flag already. Yep. And what is that flag? Ugh. Ooh, Maryland. That's, oh, that's disgusting. Yep, so... <laughs> no if no I... offense to Maryland, but your flag is appalling. <laughs> so if both of them see Maryland, or one of them sees Maryland straight away, I'd put a guess in immediately there. Yeah, for sure. And then kind of instantly, because like your chances of getting more points uh, there are a lot better. I mean, you can even zoom in and try and find... Uh, some of the national parks because it looks like it's right by a national park. Maryland. Maryland is not that big, so. Why was I looking at Massachusetts? Uh, Assateague and Loopy right above Baltimore here. Yep. I don't actually know where the Assateague State Park is, but. Musk has also guessed, but Musk guessed the other side. Big stuff. Oh! <laughs> Very big star. Oh, very close to the to the sea here. Yeah. Yeah, we're starting off with the NA. And uh, already lost distance. more than half his points with the yeah. mask. So this have... is looking like that, that definitely Chinese. So Taiwan, I guess. <laughs> Which one is it where the stripes on the pole go down to the floor? Uh, Must be Taiwan. Yeah, because it's driving on the right. Yes. And China, mainland China, doesn't have uh, like any geogesic coverage. It has a couple of geospheres, I think. Yeah, and and like a couple of musea that are like. Yeah. Did, yeah, did they say that in English, musea, or is it just museums? Museums, where they easy. Okay. Musk has guessed for Taiwan. Okay. Let's see where Loopy goes. I am currently and Loopy went for South Korea. So yeah, big round point. for Musk here. Big rounds to start with. Though. Yeah. And now we get into the multipliers. Like a sim. Oh no, we have one more before the multipliers. But a similar round like that for either player, and they could be out straight away. And this is UK by the looks of things. Actually, no. But the road signs are European of some sort. Um, oh, wow. Nicht nie wood. Bestiach. Something like that. My, my Cyrillic is pretty bad. <laughs> it's better than mine. I, yeah, I don't know what to make of that. I just told you. Oh, yeah. We've Good. got uh, the old Soviet kilometer markers here. So, it's already uh, 
something. <laughs> Doesn't oh. help you any further because Cyrillic is also already ex-communist. Yeah, you know what I was saying about uh, forgetting the prediction for the previous game? Yeah, I forgot it. <laughs> and Musk has guessed? I mean, I would say Russia. I, yeah, I think I would as well. But Russia is pretty big, so... It certainly and is. It was somewhere very far into Russia. So not that big a difference. Yeah. There. Are we back in the States again? Wow. We indeed are. Now all the US. <laughs> uh, uh, we've got pro. two Europeans or quasi Europeans, so Wait, there's a guy in a there's two guys in a cowboy hat waving Where? beside the road. Uh near the Sabre transportation support. There's, just, there's a guy in a cowboy hat, the other one in a baseball hat, without a shirt on, I think. Oh yeah, there. <laughs> anyway, back to the game. No, he does have a shirt on. It's like a rat shirt. Oh, right. <laughs> nice. Oops. So one of the no annoying things I find with the US is with uh, a lot of English-speaking countries, I can like look at the bins and kind of tell what kind of area they are. But because stuff in the US is all done privately, they just have the name of the company on it, so it doesn't mm, yeah, yeah, yeah. Like UK, that's the first thing I look for if I spawn in a residential road. Look for the bin that says like Leicestershire City Council or something, and you're like, ah, oh, nice. Perfect. Yeah, they started with that in Belgium as well, so. Yeah. Otherwise, it would just be uh, like bags that they would go, come and collect, but. Yeah. That's Purple Heart City. No idea. Yeah, no idea, but <laughs> I just saw the sign. Oh, if it's Arlington Acres, Arlington in the US is, I believe it's... Uh, oh god, where is it? Yes, speaking 20 words, Magic Man. <laughs> I think it's down by Washington. Arlington. Yeah. We'll it's like where they have a lot of the... Um, uh, Civil War graves. On the eve. Or Military Cemetery, that's the one. Um, Arlington. Yeah, it's uh, just in Washington, actually. In Washington? Yeah, so it's like a sub district of Washington. Oh, yeah, Arlington, yeah. And Does I've this look like thing... Arlington? <laughs> no, that's what's confusing me, but I'm thinking like, maybe if it's called Arlington Acres, it might be somewhere around that area. But Fair then enough, again, enough. also another thing with the US is there tend to be multiple streets with the same name. Loopy went for uh, North Philly, Allentown, uh, Pennsylvania. And uh, Musk went for Alabama. Huh. And it was oh. Oklahoma. <laughs> oh, we got back the US. So Loopy's in trouble here. Loopy's in the red zone. If this was Pokemon, he'd be making a really annoying noise with his health. Well, only Gen 1. Only Gen 1, true. Apparently that's like a sound glitch. That's not even meant to be in the game. But it speeds up your game. Yes. So or... for speedrunners, you want to yeah, get yeah. down to Red Bar as quickly as possible. Okay, we have NL and then a, a shield with NL. I don't know what that means, but... <laughs> uh, New Zealand, I, I don't imagine. No, no, no. New Zealand no. is NZ, but... This be looking NAD Mexican. Because cool. there's like a Mexican flag on the side of the building. It's also rare to see the like that type of shield as road signs. Yeah. Road a lot of South America tends to have a uh, like a more U.S. style crest, I guess. I don't know how else mm -hmm. to describe it. So NL, what would that stand for? Nuevo Leon, probably. Maybe. It's in the north, uh, Monterey, around there. There are two big Arlington cities. Ah. <laughs> that makes sense. So yeah, I, I would place it in Nuevo Leon. But we'll see what they go for. 
they might not have spotted thing but there's a lot of NLs if you once you see that <laughs> yeah there's, there's enough to be going around definitely and you've got the Mexico signs here Monterey yeah yeah it's it's uh, Nuevo Leon it's just cool. uh, signs to Monterey and Reynosa So, Origin, what are your predictions for the winner's bracket winner? Out of who's left in it, Vixel, Chess, Chess, Bearhead, and Anonymous, who do you think is going to take the winner's bracket? Oh, uh, well, Vixel and Chess are against each other, otherwise I would say yeah. those in the semi-finals. But <laughs> nothing against Bearhead and Anonymous, but... Bixel. You reckon Bixel? Yeah. I'd say I'd say Bixel's probably the bookie's favourite right now. That's that's one yeah, of you. If you were gambling, uh, you'd probably gamble on Bixel and get the, the uh, safe odds. Actually, I don't know how high Chess's rating is. Oh. Musk, what a guess. Wow. Within two points. It was a 4998. Loopy, exactly what a guess. Oh, was that Loopy? Whoops. No, no. Loopy. With Panama. Ah. That was a... Was yeah, a, that's uh, interesting. Strong result there. But very well, very well played of uh, yeah, Musk with... 600 wow. yards. That's an insane 566 guess. meters. Got, got the right town. Yeah, like, yeah. Got the right town. Wow, Just wow, wow. Right away. That is, that's really well played. That's the uh, biggest points we've got so far, like for a single guess. I don't think we've had uh, like anyone get that close yet. So huge props to Mux. Mux yep. there. And with that, Loopy is the first one out of the tournament, sadly enough. Uh, and we now go on to the second round of the loser bracket, right? Yeah, it's uh, VT and Brico. VT versus Brico. Uh, I quit out again. Team duels with diverse world, and let's get uh, Get them in here. Pexo as well, maybe. If he has time to commentate them. A couple more. Yeah, all good. All right. And Brick OS presents. Now VT. In his own words. Ready as a bird in the ocean. That is Except a, that a he is not in then. here, so. <laughs> <laughs> and Brico also just left. Ah, there we are. Yeah, Musk, big W. It was a very nice yeah. guess. Ah, uh, fair enough, Loopy. I don't think Panama has geogastro footage, uh, like coverage. Uh. All right, right. VT is in. VT is in. So, we'll start the next one here. Loser sound two. Loser goes out. Winner gets another chance. This could be quite a big game. U.S. flag though straight away. So yep. 
And Immediately. From what I've heard, Brico is good in the US. Yeah. So, uh, what are we thinking here? <laughs> uh, I don't know. What What are all these it's got, flags? It's got tram lines, which is interesting. So it must yeah. be a relatively major city. The problem is I don't know which. And VT going for the first guess. VT went for northwest. Went for New York itself. That okay. is a bold move. It might well, be Brico going for Maryland. Maryland. Not Washington. And in fact, it was... Marietta. It's interesting that there were tram lines there, weren't there? Yeah. I don't know how many American places have trams. Yeah, they're quite common in Europe, but... To be honest, yeah. I don't know a lot of... Uh... No. Yeah, US cities at all, so... Yeah. Never been. What are we thinking here? It's Northern Hemisphere. Oh, the difficult one. Um, I think it's European. Uh, yeah, it's uh, Cyrillic. Just a sign, so... Bulgaria, maybe? It's a weird one. It's a really weird one. Maybe, maybe even like... Um, like in North Macedonia or Montenegro or something. Possible. Serbia. The, yeah. I think it's somewhere over there. The somewhere in that kind of region. Yeah, yeah. Southeast Europe. And VT. VT. Locking in. VT has gone for middle of Russia. Middle of Russia. Wow. Interesting. While I mean, Brico it's... went for the north of Greece. What right. I was thinking, so. So two Cyrillic countries, but quite far apart. And, and oh, it was go. just Greece, okay. <laughs> yeah, Greece is not Cyrillic, it's Greek. Oh yeah, good point. Then it, then it, it was a very vague sign, so uh, I blame that one. All right, yeah. we're, so we're in Austria. Looks like it. I see the Austrian outline and mountains, so we are in the... West. Brico went Austria, but went for Vienna. Vienna is a safe bet. There's often a lot of Google coverage around uh, Vienna. For sure. But the problem but is Austria. As there are mountains, country. I think we're more west than that. Oh no, okay. I take back my. Uh, <laughs> everything I said. Very nice guess from, uh, from Brico. I have not been playing well today <laughs> uh, wow that's a big guess from Berkeley. yep and Starting you know what there. i was thinking yeah denmark uh so on the sign there's an o with a strike through it i don't know if that helps but yeah so it's, it's denmark, denmark yeah, yeah. bt's got some points on the board now because the strike through is Denmark and Norway, if I right, yeah. remember correctly. I think that's right, because uh, Sweden and Finland use the O with two dots over it. Yep. This, the, the game's liking spawning us over rivers today. Uh, Suvanto Savu. And <laughs> VT instant guess, wow. 7468, so I think that's usually like Scandinavian road numbering. Where did you guess? Uh, VT guess, yeah, Scandinavia guess Sweden. And Draco in it was Hungary. Very nice. Wow. It was Finland. Barely. <laughs> and VT staying alive here while in the red, but nice guess there. UK? By the looks of things? No, no, no. They're driving on the rally, right. There's a yellow number plate at the back of that car, though, which is usually... Wait. Okay. Why is that car driving on the right? Or is that parked? Is that the parked car? Oh, it's, it's probably good. parked, yeah. We... Oh, yeah, this is UK. <laughs> All the UK flags here as well. I was just looking at parked cars. Reed, Moulton, Wickhampton, Norfolk. Okay, so looking kind of east UK, uh, around uh, Norwich. 
Brico uh, went for Birmingham. Um, Bix, uh, not Bix, or VT went for London. Yeah, it's right around Norwich. VT staying alive for another Just round. Out. Wow. This will be a big comeback fight. for VT. Can we have a look? Oh, we can't quite look enough over to see the sign, but it looks a bit Yeah, what is that rock? <laughs> Uh, but on the other side of the road, it's a highway. Uh, Brico went for Canada, Alberta, right near Edmonton. Yeah. Oh, Estonia from BT. This could be Brico's round. Yeah. And it was it was Alberta. Wow, big gas here. Big gas. Uh, Brico. A lucky BT. And taking the victory. Well played, both of you. That was that was a good game. Um. Uh, VT staying alive there for three rounds, winning three, and uh, Bricka also winning the first three, but then, yeah, the end one. Very good guess there. So, Bricko moves on and VT is unfortunately out of the tournament so next one is would you guess it origin of chaos who's that guy versus yeah, or origin of chaos after a shocking performance in the first round <laughs> <laughs> shocking australia and, performance shocking australia performance Uh, yeah, what uh, Bixels just said, like, check the uh, uh, donation page for what's it called, because there might be some more stuff on there. Like, the prize pool might be going up. Oh, yeah, yeah, the... I, I get the notifications here on my phone, but they are not uh, linked with uh, the notifications yeah, on stream. Yeah, no. But thanks, Pixel. <laughs> I'll uh, be sure to count it all up at the at the end. Uh, so, all right. are you going to head out for this one, or are you going to uh, stay in here and I'll put you off for a bit? No, we'll head out. Just you know, fairness. Yeah. All right, let's uh, let's stay alive in the tournament, shall we? Well, uh, while we're waiting, I'll put the brackets here so you can see how we are doing. We've got uh, Big Cell, Cheswiz, and Bearhead Anonymous in. Uh, The winner's bracket, they will be fighting it out to for a spot in the semi-finals and then Breaker just won against uh, VT and I'll be going against Musk to fight for a fight, uh, well, in a fight to stay alive. Let's get back in here and let's start. Uh, Bearhead, I'll post it after, after my game. Uh, fair dealing. Oh, this 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 looks like this looks like US. This is US. Oh God, what the fuck is that? That looks like um, somewhere here, no? <laughs> Virginia. Looks like Virginia. Has about the same shape, so I'm just going Virginia. Might be wrong though. Might be oh, it's probably Kentucky. Damn. Yeah, yeah. No, it's Kentucky. Ah. Uh, right. Musk had the right idea. I had the wrong idea here. 
It was too fast. Where, where the fuck is that sign go? The fuck are these signs going? La planche, valette. Uh, French? Yeah, this is France. Uh, it's more like somewhere over here, I think. France is pretty big, but not that big that you lose a lot of points in the early rounds. About equal. He's a bit closer there, yeah. Right, next one. Looking European again. Uh, Papa, is he Forster? Okay, looking UK. Want to say this is UK? Honestly, without course, I don't. Yeah, it's UK. Okay. Uh, go like around Manchester. Hey, <laughs> On the board, you get a bit of damage. Right, South America. Uh, what the fuck is happening with my camera here? What the fuck is happening here? Okay, what is this? Um, okay, so it's in, in English. We sure this is North America and not like Southeast Asia. Because if it's in English, one would think that we might be uh, in Philippines. But if I went this way and highway boundary, bugger bloop, 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 bloop. It's not a cruise. Bagahoopy, Carigara, Road. So maybe we're like, um, what is that, Puerto Rico? Maybe? I'm going for Puerto Rico. Yeah, let's go. I I have no other ideas. <laughs> I don't want to keep looking. If I'm out, I'm out. I didn't join to win anyway. Oh, it was Philippines in the end, okay. This looking very Dutch. Might be Belgium to be honest. Nah, I, I think I would have I should have put it closer to Belgium. But maybe, maybe. 
Hey, you. No? Actually, very close. Wow. Nice. And right back into the lead. <laughs> oh god, what the fuck is this? So I wanna go for Australia here. But... Australia always messes me up, man. The sun is quite clearly in the north there. How does this car look? It's a green plate, yeah, that's Australia, I think. Let's go for like New South Wales or something. I know. Probably not in Northern Territory or something. Yeah. Australia is quite big. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, okay. Fucking Australia, South Africa. Two countries I'm never going. Okay, but this is looking Australian. Well, either Australian or like, I know Singapore or something. The road is so wide. But everyone seems to be driving on the left. Let's see, Can we, can we get in here? Dot org, no, why, why is it dot org? Why would you make it .org and not like dot whatever country we're in? Yeah, they're driving on the left. So let's put it like in Canberra. So maybe in Brisbane or something. Yeah? Caroline Way. Oh, let's go. What should be New Zealand instead? Or like UK, God forbid. Oh, it was New Zealand, yeah. But this is this is big. This is big damage. This be the big, big damage. All right. Comeback victory, let's go.